In this video, we're going to show you how to set up your Logic Analyzer for Windows. The first thing that we're going to need to do is download the drivers for our Logic Analyzer. So navigate to the following web page. Then on that web page, click the Download for Windows button. Wait for the download to finish. And once it's finished, run the installer that you just downloaded. And when it's done, you can click that you don't want to launch the Logic application and click Finish to exit the installer. The next thing that we want to download is PulseView. This is the program that we will use to look at the waveforms that our Logic Analyzer collects. So now we're going to navigate to this web page. On this web page, download the 64 bit release version of PulseView for Windows. Again, wait for the download to finish, and then launch the installer that you just downloaded. Once the installer completes, plug the USB cable for the logic analyzer into your computer. Then plug the other end into the logic analyzer. On the logic analyzer, you should see two red LEDs light up. Using the DuPont connector cables, connect some of the channels of your logic analyzer to the ground and 3.3 volt pins coming out of your tiny Pico. We're just going to be using this for testing that we can actually see them. Now on your computer, open PulseView. In this box, you should see two devices that you can select, the Sally Logic Analyzer and the demo device. Make sure you select the Sally device. Now we can try and capture a waveform. At the top of Pulse View, click the Run button. Let it run for a little while and press Stop. The channel that you connected to ground with the DuPont cable should now appear as a red line in the trace. Excellent. Your Logic Analyzer has been set up correctly. Thanks.